Wow, day six already. Can you believe it? Where did the first five days go? I trust that those five days have been a great blessing to you as they have been to me, as the Father has released more revelation into your spirit and drawn you closer to our Lord Jesus Christ and that you have received the ministry of the Holy Spirit in ways that you can explain and in ways that it's like, wow, <laughs> that's been my experience. Well, I haven't been perfect uh, in keeping the fast all five days either. There have been some slip-ups, there's been some omissions, uh, but the Lord is good. And if that's uh, your story, then hey, here we are on the second half. We can change all of that and start with a new resolve, right? So, Psalm 19 is the focus uh, for day six. And in this psalm, David begins by admiring and appreciating creation and God as creator. But then his focus shifts in verse 7 to the law of the Lord. And friends, quite often we hear the word law and we tend to cringe, but David looks at the law as a blessing, as a gift from God that guides him. We are driven by the Holy Spirit, but we're also directed by God's word. Amen. And so on this day six, I would uh, encourage you to spend some time asking the Holy Spirit to reveal to you how great it is to have the gift of God's Word to guide us. And perhaps you can reflect upon certain passages of Scripture that have really guided you, helped you, seen you through some difficult times. And once again, let's stay in that atmosphere of praise. And friends, uh, whenever we talk about the Word of God, the Word of God not only comforts, but the Word of God also convicts. And if there are areas in our lives where this needs to repentance, then friends, let's do that too. Amen? So, until we see you again on day 7, it's Pastor Jeeva Sam saying, Shalom.